Hey guys, this is XXC Joker here, and I'm bringing you out a really cool gameplay. It is Dog Days Battle Mode, and I'm excited to show you guys my very, very first Modern Combat 4 gameplay from me, because I'm the best, and so yeah. Well, let's get started. Um, I'm going to use my FIFA and my backup weapon for this game, for uh, gameplay. Anyway, so, um, oh, sorry, I'm going to put the guns, the scripts, my, my gun attachments in the description. You guys want to know what my gun attachments are, so you guys won't be asking me in the, the comments, so I will have to reply to every single one of you. So, yeah, um, so, um, basically, a lot of people have been asking me, uh, what's the difference between Modern Combat 3 and Modern Combat 4? Is Modern Combat 4 better than Modern Combat 3? Or is it Modern Combat 3 better than Modern Combat 4? But the thing is, guys, um, Modern Combat 3, uh, a lot of people say it's about skills. Modern Combat 3 is about skills. That's what they say. And sometimes I agreed with some, sometimes I don't, because, like, I actually don't think that's how it works. You know? This is what I think. Modern Combat 4, is, it's all about the perks, and it's all about the weapons, you know. It's a cycle, you know. You use a stun bullet, there's a way to block that, you know. There's a way to get... Away, get that thing away from you. You know, so if someone's using stun bullets at you, you can you you can put on that mask thing to um, to not receive those damage or stun or stun bullets and all the stun grenades and all that stuff. You can, there's a way out of it. If someone's using a p armor piercing route, there's a way out of it. But you can use a different kind of perk to get away from it. If someone's using this kind of you know, there's a way out of anything you want to get away from. It. So if I like I played with one person, like a, for example Gaga, S S S S B Gaga, for example, he I, he used stun bullets, and so I got away away from that by using a stun mask, you know, the thingy that get away from the stun masks and all that stuff. Uh, anyway, he, I got I, I there's a ways around stuff, you know. If, in Mighty Combat Three, you can't get away from anything. It's all about the device, you know. You have to have like a better device to, to you know, play better. You know, so if you if you have like, if you you know try hard or something, I don't care. But anyway, the thing is, Modern Combat Three is different than Modern Combat Four. Modern Combat Four is probably the device as well. Like I don't know if I'm lagging or not because if you guys can tell me in the comments if I'm lagging or anything, yeah. But anyway, um, kind of got mad right there. I'm mad, bro. Anyway. Like you see, like if I, I played against a Modern Combat 4 player with an iPad Mini, and he was actually really fast and everything, and uh, he, he done it really great. You know, his aiming is great, and I don't know if it's his skills or his iPad or something. But the, I'm all I'm saying is probably iPad and skills probably. But anyway, the difference is um, it's all about the you know skills sometimes, and. Sometimes it's all about the perks and weapon kits. So if I have uh, landmines, landmines just make you waste time. And then by the time I get somewhere, I'm gonna get like backstabbed or something. See, as everything's running slow. See, like landmines, they waste so much time. Like right now, see, like I would have ra ran away with it, you know, without the landmines and would have been killed. But landmines just keep making everything worse. But anyway, so um, yeah, I mean. I think Modern Combat 4 is a great game, good to play with. I actually like how everything's working. There's things that Modern Combat 3 cannot do than Modern Combat 4. It's like, you know, like spinning thingies, and Modern Combat 4 has like spinning thingies and everything. But Modern Combat 3 is everything still, you know. You know, nothing burning, nothing doing anything. It's still the same. But Modern Combat 4 is just amazing. And I don't like that. Also, so there's funny body parts, you know, like when you shoot somebody, they fly up in the sky and they do something crazy in the sky, you know. Sometimes, you know, you can screenshot something really funny, you know, and show your friends and all that crazy pictures. Usually that's what I do, but it's just hilarious, you know, seeing these kind of funny pictures everywhere. Oh, well, you know, yeah, so that's basically one thing. Also, a lot of people have been saying that I suck so bad every time I play with them or something. Honestly, it's probably they do have skills or they have good weapons or whatever they have. But the thing is, about me, is that I play 6 hours or 12 hours a day, maximum. Usually 16 if I am excited and I feel great. But um, basically, the thing is about other players, they're, they play like... They go outside, they have schools, they gotta knife that kid out. Anyway, they go to school, they have lives, they have work, they have everything. 
and basically they do everything, you know, they have their lives, they have their family, they have their work, they have business to take care of, they do everything, and then when they sit down and they start playing Modern Combat 4, and they're extremely good, like, you don't know why they're so good, but they're extremely good, it's because they have their life, you know, if I, if, like, for me, I play Excel for 13 hours a day, that's sometimes 16, but they, it doesn't mean that I'm a better player than everyone, it's just that I'm tired sometimes, and I can't take that much control, it's just like, playing, staring at a glass, a piece of glass, finally knife that kiddo, uh, staring at a glass, yeah, I'm probably gonna knife that kiddo again, there's, there's gonna be someone right behind me right now, yep, like I said, um, uh, basically, like, sometimes, you gotta, um, what was I talking about, I just got brainwashed, anyway, um, what was I talking about, um, I forgot what I was talking about. Kind of got brainwashed in this kind of gameplay. Anyway, um, basically, usually you gotta. Sometimes I suck because I play 16 hours a day. And if my eyes are staring at a piece of glass that's been flashing right into my eye, and for like a past hour, oh, I knifed him again. I keep, you know, like that's the thing. You know, I stare at the glass for like 16 hours and. And I do go outside, I do do everything outside, I do sometimes, I hang out with sometimes, with my family, do a bunch of things, go outside, do everything. You know, I do hang out sometimes. Sometimes I try to go on YouTube, watch some videos, do some stuff, and then I just go on the iOS community, you know, wow, less than two minutes. I do some stuff, and I actually enjoy, you know, doing it, and I actually have fun. And, you know, sometimes I'm bored, you know, and I'm homeschooled. I don't have nothing to do. And that's, you know, basically I just go play Modern Combat 4 because there's nothing to do. So, um, basically, well, all I'm saying is that modern, some no-lifers are not that good, you know. They probably are some, but they're not so good. There are players that only play six or two hours a day, you know. And they are probably good, but they did have their lives and all that stuff. I'm going to try. I was going to get you guys a good game point, but I keep dying so much. But anyway, um, I'm trying to raise my KDR, but I keep failing. I keep going down because of these new tubes and backstabs and all those crazy little landmines. But anyway, um, guys, thank you for watching my videos. Uh, I, I will try to upload more tomorrow. And... Uh, like more gameplay tomorrow and um yeah probably try to play vip or manhunt or capture the flag just leave in a comment down below what map and mode i should play and what attachment should i use and i'll try to try to find out which one to use anyway thanks for watching like and subscribe i'll try to upload tomorrow see you next time